to the McAllen Art Walk. It's a pleasure having you here and being here. This is an incredible event organized by a group of individuals and citizens and business owners. And this is a perfect example of the, of the coordination that can happen between the private entities and with the coordination of the city. We are reaching that level where it's becoming a cultural and entertainment destination. And that's what we're here for. That, that's why I'm so glad to see the turnout that we have in Artwork. You know, the McAllen Artwork has been going on uh, for a few years now. We wanted to create something that people c could take with them if they didn't have the five hundred dollars, a thousand dollars of those big pieces and uh, this is the perfect place for people who visit that can take something with them to remember uh, McAllen or the McAllen Hour Walk. People are taking the time to to work with the, their passion and what they really like and, and, and they're, they're able to come up with the beautiful uh, hand crafted uh, uh, small pieces that they can they can put all their, all their love and everything that they have to express. This is a uh the line Luma and it's designed by Lupana. She's an artist from Monterrey. Uh, it's a really interesting line. You have to uh, see it to appreciate. She's come out in several national magazines like Style. Uh, her lines have been shown in uh, Rodeo Drive up in uh, California. Uh, I can't say enough of it. I love it. I use it every day. My name is Adriana. We're very proud to be here on McAllen on this art walk. We're showing the people this huichole art. We have a foundation in Monterrey. We're helping them. Okay, these huicholes are the, those, these indigenous. They live in Nayarit, in Tepic. They are known because of their art. The process to make this, this is a wood box. They use wax. It's named Cera de Campeche and then they, they place one by one. The Art Walk in McAllen, Texas has turned into a wonderful event and it gives an opportunity for a wide range of artists uh, to show their work and to be seen by the public. And I remember the first Art Walk had about 250 people and now I understand there are over 4,000 people I think it's tremendous for the community as well as for the artists because there are uh, such a wide variety of artists and wonderful talent here in the Rio Grande Valley in northern Mexico and it just fits into kind of our, our culture. Well, my, my work uh, is abstract uh, paintings, right, mixed media and, and um, Sort of a, a freedom, you know. You know, it's 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 not uh, anything that uh, you should uh, stress stress out over, right? Uh. Well, if there's one single thing that has really stimulated the arts in this area, it is Art Walk. And that's the reason the arts in McAllen are so vibrant. The people who host Art Walk nine months out of the year have worked so hard for the last four years and the crowds have just gotten tremendously large. And what I like about it, what I think is really outstanding, is that young kids, 15, 17, whatever, have something to do in McAllen beyond getting into trouble. They can take their dates, go with their friends, go to any number of galleries, the library, the public library, and meet other people, have a good time, a good, clean, wholesome time. Well, the Art Walk has provided us with a great opportunity to be another venue to, for art. And uh, one, one of the things that I'm very proud to do is to promote mainly local artists. It's a wonderful feeling that I'm able to get across to the, a customer the importance of having art in their home and to be able to incentivate the artist to keep creating art.